What do you think students can do to like get preferential treatment? Again, as you as you're saying <laughs> earlier, like it's a very busy time of year. You have tons of things on your desk. Like, if I want you to like look at mine first, or give me like as you're saying, you've got lim- Benno saying limited capacity and all these things. Like, what gives the student the best shot at getting the largest line or the best price from from your sales? I come from the analytics side, so the comfort around the analytics is important.、Um, there are, as you know, internal processes, right? The submission comes in. There's the underwriting side. There's the pricing side. Sometimes,、uh, because the deal is so large, it needs to be referred upwards.、Mm-hmm. And normally, at some point, someone is going to ask, "Are we confident about this deal?"、Mm-hmm. Maybe,、mm-hmm. maybe not, and. A lot of that comfort comes down to what is the information and data given to us, and if everyone on the table can say we are confident because we were provided A, B, and C, and these things、uh, affirms some of the messages of the pre-renewal meetings we had, say in the summer, everybody gets comfortable quicker and the process is smoother. And I guess that gives you the chance to. Sort of invest more heavily in that relationship as well. If you've got that comfort, yeah. Can, I mean, I、yeah. think it's natural that a, a reinsurer, any reinsurer, would want to work with somebody that they trust,、mm-hmm. that they believe in, and it comes through in the data. Yeah. And how does that conversation go if it's you know a client you you're trying to grow with or a client that you've been working with for a long time, but the sort of answer across the board is sort of like. We're not so confident on this one. Sort of, what is the takeaway from that meeting? Do you decline those risks full stop? Do you sort of turn around and just hedge your price up? What's the sort of way you navigate it when the answer is we don't have confidence in this one? Um, it depends on what is it that we're not confident in, because、mm. the the weight we place on that may be a small thing. Or, or it may be a very material thing. So, for example, if say、um, they are radically changing their mix of business,、mm. uh, and by doing so, they the student believes that、uh, loss ratio is going to improve by I don't know five points. Okay. So, what does the data tell us? Are they making that change? Is there evidence to show that the change will? Have five points、mm. improvement. So, data.、Mm. 